good morning it is saturday the 22nd of july i thought i'd start another little vlog but before i tell you what i'm up to this weekend it is macy's first birthday so we've got her some treats and presents we've wrapped them up we've got her a little birthday hat and a cake um, and we're gonna let her open them which i think she'll actually really enjoy because she likes ripping things apart so she's gonna enjoy opening the presents so yeah she's one today which honestly just feels insane because she does look like an adult dog now but it doesn't feel like it's been a year and obviously when we got our two cats they were already like four or five so um this is our first pet's first birthday <laughs> ready for the day i've just filmed a little like get ready with me real so that'll be on my instagram um but i am going to newcastle for brunch we're going to slug and lettuce i'm very excited and also very hungry um so i'm going with people that i have um not actually met but met online like through facebook and instagram so i mentioned in my last vlog when i went pottery painting five girls on instagram that i follow made a facebook group for people to like make friends and chat um and we have like a group chat for everyone in like the northeast of england so um we've been chatting in there for a few weeks and yeah we're finally making it out the group chat and going for brunch we'll vlog a little bit probably just the food to be honest um it's a horrible day it's so miserable outside um, I'm wearing my new black dress from Morrison's which I absolutely love but I've also got like my little black headband my black necklace black boots and a black leather jacket and now I'm like is that too much black I might take my new blue bag because then that's adding a little pop of color I never normally wear all black like I'm quite a colorful person I'm just gonna wear the dress and sandals but obviously it's bloody raining so I think I'll take this bag anyway I'm gonna finish getting ready and head off to the train station. from brunch i've got my little name tag still on um i had a really good time the food was really good it was just really nice and um, meeting everyone in person obviously we've been talking in a group chat for weeks and um, i didn't really vlog that much while i was out i think literally just like my food which is the main thing i suppose um but i'm really anxious like 
in person like in real life like consider i'm somebody that posts my life all over social media i'm actually very anxious um so yeah just filmed a few clips that's mainly going in the office um but yeah i'm just gonna get my pajamas on now because it's about six half six um i picked up like a pizza and things from sainsbury's on the way home and um, for me and james to have tea and we're gonna watch manifest which we've been watching on netflix which is really good um and just have a chilled evening a nice day planned tomorrow as well i've got some friends coming over from work i'm gonna have some picky food so i don't know if i'll film much more this evening but if not i will check back in with you tomorrow Thank you. Excuse the messy hair. I had a shower and then went and did the food shop and it was raining. Um, I'm just about to get ready because some girls from work are coming over. We're going to have some food. Like everyone's got a different thing to bring. So mine was like picky bits. I've got like little sausage rolls and can't even remember what else but anyway so we're gonna have some food just chat um it was originally gonna be like a little party for macy but it was technically a birthday yesterday that's her whinging and um and she got all her presents then so yeah we're just gonna have a chilled afternoon and then we're gonna go next door and watch the f1s i've got my new f1 top on so that's the plan and um, i'll show you the food once it's all laid out because i'm currently just trying to clean the whole house in like 10 minutes shocking lighting um it's now about 8 p.m i think um i've had a really nice day but obviously i didn't film much yet again um so i might include footage from either wednesday coming up or the next weekend and just put it all as one large video otherwise this is going to be the shortest vlog ever anyway me and james are about to watch a movie and just have a chilled evening i'm very bloated from all of the food because not only did i have all of those like snacks and like picky bits i also had a sunday lunch so yeah really bloated right now and um, but before we sit down and watch a film i'm just gonna have a little bit of a pamper i've had such a big breakout on my face and i just don't know what's going on i'm firstly just popping some lip balm on because my lips are honestly just so dry um, and the face mask that I'm going to use is the one that I got out of the girlies uh, goodie bag from the pottery painting event speaking of um, I've actually booked to go to their London event which is um, a collaboration with MAC Cosmetics Um, it honestly sounds like such an amazing day and um, so I've booked to go in August on my own to London so I'm a little bit scared about it but I think it will just be a really good time so yeah I'm gonna use this face mask which is the Dr Papa your gorgeous skin soothing and nourishing sheet mask and I just thought these ingredients looked really good considering my skin definitely needs a little bit of TLC right now so as I said um obviously I've really not filmed much um today or yesterday like probably the least I filmed and um it's obviously good in a way because I've just been really enjoying myself that I've just not thought to pick up the camera um but for the purpose of vlogging um I'm trying not to get in the routine of just vlogging everything and anything because I think that's what I started to do the other year and it just got a little bit um boring and overwhelming like having to edit so much so I'm gonna try and rein it in a little bit and um just pick up the camera when I feel like I've got something interesting to show. So yeah, I'm definitely just going to put a few days of footage together um, as one vlog. But I do have lots of um, exciting like hauls and routines coming up as well. Oh my god, I've made a mess of this, um, which will be exciting. But yeah, I definitely just need to chill out for the rest of the evening now because I feel like my social battery is well and truly drained. 
um, obviously went out with the girls yesterday and there was literally over 20 of us and then I've had five girls from work around today and yeah it's just been a lot and honestly I've just done the worst job of unwrapping this face mask. Face masks never fit on my skin very well so this is definitely not going to be a flattering look but let's try i actually hate the coldness it's really cold right now like really miserable outside it's like raining and i think i might have to put my snuddy on which i can't remember the last time i wore my snuddy um i don't know if to put this down because it's like trapped underneath oh god i'm making a right mess of this Good job I'm not creating content for them. <laughs> okay, that'll do. So yeah, I'm gonna go downstairs and watch a film and then I'll check back in with you either on Wednesday or Saturday. Good morning, it is now Wednesday. Um, I wasn't sure whether to vlog today because I said in one of my other clips that I feel like I've got to the point where I'm just um like vlogging everything and um I need to just kind of vlog as and when I've actually got things to share with you. So I wasn't going to, but then my mum asked if I wanted to go to North Allerton with her, my grandma and granddad for a little afternoon out and I thought, do you know what, that'll be nice to vlog. And also, me and James have been looking through old photos because it's been two years since Ruby um our black main coon cat um since she was abandoned by her old owner um, and it took us two months of feeding her for her to finally come in the house and I was looking at old photos of then but I was looking at obviously photos around that and like I just feel like obviously it felt quite nostalgic even though it's already been two years but I feel like I don't feel like myself at the moment. Like, you know when you just, like, lose yourself a little bit, which sounds so cringy, but I don't know. Like, I feel like I'm just that focused on the pet, the house, work. Like, I just feel like I've lost me a little bit. Like, I was just looking at pictures of, like, my baths. Like, I used to have so many, like, colourful baths and I used to do my makeup all the time. I was blonde, which I'm not anymore, but I am getting blonde to put back in my hair in August because I do miss it. Um, you know, I was just, like, treating myself to little bits, which... I'm definitely fortunate in what I can buy for myself and what I get sent to myself but it's not like the same where I always have money to like treat myself as I used to if that makes sense because bills are just so ridiculous at the moment um so yes anyway that was a bit of a ramble but I'm gonna have a nice little afternoon out I'm going swimming later as well um I've got loads of PR stuff recently to take um content off so I might give you a sneak peek of that um but yeah I'm just gonna get ready for the day I'm gonna do my makeup like I used to and just enjoy it um, I'm gonna put a nice outfit on I'm gonna go out I might treat myself I've got a little bit of cash in my purse I might treat myself to something while I'm out I imagine we're gonna have some lunch as well and obviously just a bit of family time which would be nice anyway so i'm gonna get on with the day um sorry for rambling <laughs> So as you can see, 
obviously I'm now back home um, so I had a really nice afternoon out and um, we had lunch and then I had a little look around the shops and um, when I got back home I had a Starbucks little like um, caramel coffee which was very well needed because I'm so tired today I feel like I am running on like 1% energy um, I don't know why like I got my bloods done thinking it was my iron and my iron's just like slightly low not very low which it was before so I don't know what's going on but yeah definitely needed that coffee and then went to my other granddad's house to help him with his laptop because he had somehow purchased a year subscription to like an anti-virus software <laughs> which is just standard really so <laughs> I had to sort a few things out there and then we popped into Lidl came home and I just thought I'd show you the couple of bits that I got from the shop which very minimal as I said I only took five pound um, and then I also got James and Greg's um, so the first thing I saw I was honestly so excited about it is a roll on lip gloss can anyone remember these i used to have so many as a child i mean even now i get dry lips but as a child i used to get really sore painful lips and i was constantly wearing lip balm i used to have like a little lip oil roller ball that i used to take to school with me and i was always just plastering it on like not even just my lips like around my lips they were super sore um but yeah i've seen these um in boys um and my mum actually picked up a few for herself which i thought was really cute because she's gone on a cruise so she said she's going to take them with her um i got the one which is apple flavor i don't know if it really smells very appley i'm gonna give it a shake um there was also orange banana and cherry but i just quite liked the look of the green one i don't think it's obviously working yet because it's not went down it's like one of them did anyone ever play with them little like baby bottles that when you tipped it like all the milk disappeared uh but yeah anyway i'm gonna just continue to tip that until it starts oh yeah it's starting to come out now oh yeah that does smell of apple oh my god i am so excited about this anyway yes that was the first thing i got i think it was like literally like 70p or something which i thought was amazing i then got a little sheet mask um i used a sheet mask the other day which was the dr pawpaw one that i got in my girlies irl and um, little goodie bag from the pottery paint event which reminds me i need to go and pick up my plate um maybe i'll get james to go tomorrow while i'm at work if you will because i'm really excited to see it but i just don't have the time at the moment to go and get it um anyway i got the sheet mask which is the face facts ceramide skin barrier complex and um, it's a soothing sheet mask and it has hyaluronic acid and oats so i thought that would be really good for my skin because my skin is usually quite sensitive a little bit dry i've got a few more dry patches than usual um so i thought i'd give that a go and the last thing um literally only got this because my grandma was getting one and it was like two for something it's the yardley um freesia and bergamot or bergamot i can never say these things i just thought it smelled really nice and fresh um so yeah that'll probably just go like in my handbag or something um so that's everything i bought i just filmed a little uh reel for instagram and tiktok um with this i'll show you actually this is what I was taking content for, which is the Colour Science Sun Forgettable Total Protection Face Shield Flex. Um, so it's an SPF 50, um, but it also is like a bit of a skin tint. It comes out white, but then as you rub it in, it kind of like matches your skin tone, which I think is amazing. So I've just tried that. I was going to film some more content, but it's already like 5pm and I'm just so worn out right now and um, so i think i'm gonna wait till the weekend to do all this because the lighting isn't great now anyways but i've got a charlotte tilbury product which is the magic body cream i'm so excited about that obviously i do like a sit down beauty haul for these products um, and give you like a really in-depth review after using them but just as a sneak peek on my little vlog and um, i've not used any of these yet definite pinch me moment i mean so was it charlotte tilbury to be honest but i got some merit makeup which is honestly just so beautifully packaged and um, so i've got the little um flush balm because i love a blush love a liquid blush and also the shade slick um tinted lip oil which honestly looks amazing um i've then got some products from 
Urticram, if I'm saying that right. Um, it's the like really nice aloe vera range. So I thought this would be so good. Well, generally for summer, but our weather has been rubbish recently. So I definitely think I might take it on holiday with me. Ask Brand sent me this massive box. It is Charles Worthington, which is a brand I only started using October last year when I went on holiday to Spain. Um, I got some of their travel minis and really enjoyed them. So my sister then got me some shampoo and conditioner from them for Christmas. Um, so I've got a really great selection. Like I've got oils, hair masks, shampoo, conditioners, sprays, you name it. Like I've got it in here. I am honestly like really, really grateful for everything I get. But the fact that they sent me this much stuff, like I sat and worked it out and there's a £114 around about that anyway, worth of hair care products in this massive box which is definitely going to take me a long time to get through um so yeah feeling very lucky about that i think i'm about to head out and walk macy now because i literally just want to get everything done out the way and then i want to come home and just relax like pajamas on watch movies eat lots of snacks i do need to wash my hair which i'll probably do later on before bed but yeah just definitely want to get everything out of the way and just have a relaxing night because as i said i'm just feeling like so tired right now and um, i don't really have any plans this weekend other than going out for food um james is going to be away at the f1 so i'm all by myself um i think i am going to vlog this weekend we'll see um i might do some like organization bits in the house um and as i said i've got lots of content stuff to do but yes anyways um this might be the last time i talk in this vlog um so if it is thank you so much for watching sticking around with me because i just feel like i've it's been a bit chaotic this vlog like very short clips bit of rambling if you do watch these videos and you've got to this point please do let me know what you like to see in vlogs so i know for future um i will obviously share with you the rest of my day and then i'm going to end the vlog and then probably start a new one on saturday <laughs> missy good girl do you want a treat here then clever girl What are you doing?